Hi, I'm Bobby Cozy from Executive Architectural Millwork, and I want to tell you about our capabilities making PVC moldings and profiles using our five head molder. What's a five head molder? Each head is a different position in the machine. So there is a two bottom knives, two bottom positions, two sides, and one top. So on a profile, like a crown molding like so, you're going to have two side knives that put the bevel on there and one top knife to do the profile. I'll show you an example. This is a, I think around a uh, seven inch top knife for this profile here. This was a aluminum reinforced PVC handrail. As you can see, that profile fits right in there like that. This spins at a high RPM, removing the material just like you would if you were putting a piece of wood through it. PVC moldings will require a painting. And you're going to say it, and we've been asked many times, why am I going to use PVC if I still have to paint it? The thing is this, you're going to paint the PVC, and you're most likely never going to have to paint it again, like you would with a piece of wood. Also, with PVC, there is no moisture inside of it that's going to try to get out, bubble up the paint like you would with wood. Um, we can go from small, tiny moldings like this, three quarters by a half tall, up to full, multiple piece profiles like this handrail here. This really opens up your possibilities to just about anything. If you want custom column profiles, you want a custom trim package for a house, going around the uh, all the soffits and all the details. As an architect, you could draw whatever profile you want. We'll make up the knives and run the profile for you. Uh, we also do B-board, siding, shiplap, just about anything you can think of. It's, uh, it's, a, it's a great possibility for those of you willing to draw custom profiles and want something a little nicer than just what's a stock profile out there. Again, there's custom knives. This is the pattern used to make this knife here. Actually, this, this profile here. This is the top knife that went on there like so. Um, this here is called a spiral planing head. So if we're just doing a square edge like that, we're going to put this in the machine. It just runs nice and clean, takes off. You can take a half inch off each, each side, down to a quarter inch, down to a sixteenth on each pass. This machine is really, really tight with the tolerances. Um, please reach out and contact us and let us know if you can use PVC profiles on your project. Thanks for watching. One other thing I do want to mention is that all the PVC dust that we collect goes into that machine there. That's a 15 horsepower dust collector, and that's dedicated just for this. And then all that PVC dust gets shipped back to Versatex in Pennsylvania to get recycled into new material. It truly is a green material, being the fact that between the dust and all of our scrap cutoffs, they all go on a tractor trailer, go back, and get made into new materials.